Let's go. Let's start by taking the ball in the hand and pressing. And just go press, uh, keep pressing and then releasing, pressing and releasing about 10 times. And then go to the other hand, same thing, two, three, four, And then back one more time, set of 10. And the other hand. And then just roll the ball around in your hand a little bit. Sort of scribbling. Loosening up those joints. And while you're doing that, you're assessing. And we'll put the ball down on the ground. And press down three times. Moving to the knuckles, pressing down once. And uh, rotating on the heel, across the knuckles. And then roll it down each of the bones. And scribble. And reassess. Move it to the middle of the other foot and press down three times. Knuckles. Rotate. Roll it down the bones. And script. All right, we're going to bend over, slightly bend the knees, hinging at the hips. Come back up and do some wood chops through the middle of the knees. Off to the right. And to the left. Come up and shake the tree. Get that ball out of the way. Say that, didn't I? Mm. 
All right. And center, nice deep breath. Twist at the waist, swing those arms. And let's march in place. Good job. We have 20 seconds left. I'm going to go all out. I think I'm going to do some rapid squats today. You can do that, or you can do some sprinting or you could do some jumping jacks or some side jacks or nothing at all. Just keep doing what you're doing. Be safe. I'll do it in five, four, three, two, one, two. Seven, eight, fourteen, nineteen, and twenty. Nice deep breath. One more. So those hands together. On that chi ball. And then let it dance us. center to deep press. Do some motion wave breathing. And slightly forward on the way out. Exhale as we come back. And we're coming back down. Two deep breaths. Fingers and thumb together behind the back at the base of the spine. The other in star line. Here she comes. Three times around the crowd. And back down. Let's 
center. Other hand behind the back. Gather it in. Center. Draw fingertips together. Press in. While we're breathing. Interlace the fingers and then bring them up over the head. And back. the side. Other side. And slowly bring it down, uh, chest tight, push it out. And down. Lift up behind with the fingers interlaced. Get a little higher. Get a little higher yet. Oh, there it is. Bring it on across the body at the shoulder. Neck right. height. Press back. Other arm. And behind the head. Other arm. And let them extend and rotate. Switch directions. One palm up, one palm down, and just flop them back and forth. And bring your arms in and shrug. My cat is up to some mischief behind me, I can tell, I can hear. And roll back. And forward. Rotate the neck. Other direction.
So ear to shoulder, both ways. Nod. Look up at a 45 degree angle. Move it to center. Your other side, 45 degrees. Look over one shoulder. And then the other. And then look down. Let's cross one leg in front of the other and bend over, hinging at the hip, stretching that hamstring. Summing up, other foot crosses over, leaning down. Come up, legs apart, lunge to one side, stretching the abductor of the leg that is not engaged, and then switch sides into the other way. You can lean against the wall or fall onto a pole or do nothing, but stretch that calf. And reverse the position of the feet and stretch the other calf. We have a pole. Look at the quad by lifting one leg by the toes. Also stretching the ankle. And then the other. Let's start with some downward lunges to one direction. And then the other. Lateral. and the other direction. Punch it out. Big circle, pushing out. And then bring it back in, go in the other direction. Behind your back, chin tucked, and pecking like it.
swing it forward, raise it over your head, and behind. You put it behind your neck. You can either hold on with your hands or put it in the crook of your elbows and twist your torso, but keep your hips facing forward. more. Now you can drop it down and then twist at the waist. And extend back. Come back up and put the stick in front of you and we're going to do some rocking and rolling coming up on the toes, rolling back on the heels. One, two, we'll do 15, three, I'm holding a little bit longer, four, five, Nine, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. All right, we're going to continue with the stick, doing some uh, hip and leg stuff today. You're familiar with most of these. Not all. We're going to start with the kick out. We're going to do 12. Try to go a little bit higher as we move along. Five, six, seven. Ten, eleven, twelve. Hold to the other hand. Other foot comes up. Okay, now we're gonna go straight back. Don't bend the knee. One. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Other foot. And leg. Nine. Okay. We'll go laterally in one direction. One foot. And the other. Uh, 
All right, now we want you to bend your knee as you go back and almost or try to kick your butt. Two, three, four, five. Nine. And the other foot. And 12. All right, we're going to do some external hip rotations. And on any of these, uh, again, if you don't uh, feel you need a pole, don't use one. If you want to use the side of a table or stand next to a wall or the back of a chair, you can do that too. I think that's 10. And the other leg. Ten, eleven, twelve. All right, now on this one, if you uh, use a pole, you um, knee to elbow, same side, ten times on one side, or twelve times on one side, twelve on the other. If you don't use the pole, you're going to come across. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven, and twelve. Pretty good. And just uh, to see. The progress we've made. Let's um, kick forward and back and see if you notice any difference. We'll do it 12 times. One, two, three. You might want to stop in between. Four, why not? Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, and the other foot, and leg, of course. Ten, eleven, and twelve. Put the stick down. Let's put those legs to some use. And you know what? I'm going to switch the camera. I've got a three camera system going here now. So we're going to do some heel to toe walking. You're focusing on a point directly ahead of you on the wall. If you can, try going backwards, toe to heel. You want to step it up. So heel to toe going forward, looking in one direction to the side and then the other. Like so. Look. That's okay to wobble. All right. And then the other. 
very wealthy today. Yeah. Okay. Persistence. Now, as always, you can have a stick, be next to a wall, whatever you do, just be safe. Final step in the progression would be to close your eyes. See how that goes. Somehow that's easier for me today than going left to right. Go figure. Again, best to hold on to a pole while doing this. All right, let's come back and center. Couple of deep breaths. And then open up our hearts. Pause, deep breath in, exhale and send that out. Center, two deep breaths. And bringing down heavenly chi. I'm going down and getting some earth chi to bring up. To heart center. Releasing it with a exclamation of Aha! Thank you. Thank you, Tom. You're very welcome. Everybody good? Um Today is a, uh, hey Jessica, Don and Cindy and Jenny, good to see you back. Um, today is a resistance band day. So if you're sticking with us, I would start probably uh, with the light one, but you might want to go to the green one. We're going to do some bicep curls and stuff. Oh, I think I'll, I'll Challenge myself with a green one. I can remember where I put them. There we go. All right. So, in the palm of your hand with one, bring it down by your waist and just come up with the other. Nine, ten, let's do twelve. Twelve and reverse hands. Nine. 
11, 12. And again, on all of these, if you start feeling you're not able to do the whole thing or your form starts to get a little um, rickety, just stop. Stop it wherever you are and over time it will get better. All right, let's do a lateral walk. So you might want to sit down to put the band around your ankles. For this one, you can usually use a, a green or a blue if you have it. If your legs are a little stronger. And get down a little bit, bend your knees a bit in an athletic stance and go across. One, two, three, four, five, that's 10, all together, 11 and 12. Now I'm gonna switch cameras. Uh -huh. And then we're going to get down on one knee and put the band underneath the sole of one foot and pull back. One, two, three. Eight, 11 and 12 and then switch feet. Same thing, one, the spine is straight and erect. The action is coming in the arms. Six. Ten. And twelve. And now you want to put the band around the top of your knee, uh, above the knees, or above the uh, knees, not the top, the toes. And your legs are in a forward position. And we're gonna do some clamshells. Two. Four. Seven, nine, cameo appearance, twelve, and on the other side, one. Eleven and twelve. Let's go back to the first side and we'll do everything in reverse. One more time. One more set on each. You might want to adjust that band so that it's flat against the skin. Otherwise, it can be a little uh, uncomfortable. And one, two.
seven. Well, I'm going to have two balance, two on it, right? Great exercise for the boots. Ready? On the side, in three, two, one, two. Nine. Okay. So now move the band down to underneath one sole. And come in a 90-90 kneeling position. And we'll come back. One, two, Three, four, five, six, and on seven through 12, come back and then rotate your arm out when you get to the back position, giving that rotator cuff a little action. Four, five, and the final six on that side. And then the other leg, six straight back and then six rotating at the shoulder. One, two, three, six, and now we'll rotate. Five, six. All right. Stand up or sit down and put the um, bands around your ankles. I'm going to switch the camera. Let's do this one. And we'll do that lateral walk. Four, five, six, eight, nine, and ten. 11 and 12. And finally, I should probably switch the camera again. Do the bicep curl. One, bear with me as I get these camera positions. Straighten out, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and any other hand. Last set of the day, two. Ten, eleven. Excellent. Hope that worked for you. I like that too. Oh, good. Good. How you feeling, Jenny? Good. Thank you, Tom. You're welcome, Art. Take care. Have a good day.
I will. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Tom. You're welcome, Don. Good to see you. Suzanne, hi. Hello, Tom. Hello. Take care. Thank Which, you, Tom. Thank you, you're Tom. You're welcome, Suzanne. Take care. You too. Bye-bye. I don't, I don't. See you tomorrow, Tom. People have already left.